Today on MTG Unpacked, we're getting stuck into 12 packs of Corset 2021 for patrons. And we've got Teferi front and centre here, hoping we'll get the crazy pulls. Let's introduce the patrons. We have SP, NKS, Ash, Geekalotl, Barboso, Sebastian Blackwell, and finally Andres Castillo. Thank you for being patrons. Okay, so we're going to grab four packs here for SP and KS. And then I think everybody else, yep, gets two packs. So we'll hand those out like so. Alright, let's get into it. Starting off here, SP and KS, thank you for being a patron. And the patrons get the rares, mythics, foils, and anything over a buck. And you might notice these packs are the other way around than usual. Uh, because they are the Japanese packs. Okay, we start off here with a Beast Token, Jungle Hollow, and a rare Necromentia. Sorcery for three, choose a card name other than the basic land card name, search target opponents, graveyard hand and library for any number of cards with that name, and exile them. That player shuffles their library, then creates a 2 2 black zombie creature token for each card exiled from their hand this way. Okay, and Uncommon's Talarian Kraken, that's pretty cool. Bolt Hound, Teferi's Tutelage, let's move things around here, and the Commons Truffle Snout, Mind Rot, you watch too many videos on this channel, you rot your mind, and discard two cards, but it's all good, it just clears right up, you keep watching, you're all set, Thrill of Possibility, Secure the Scene, Tome Anima, Feet of Resistance, Run Afoul, Spell Gorge a Weird, that's quite a bright one, Liliana's Steward and Sabretooth Mauler. Okay, on to the next pack here. Let's see if we can get something good from this Chandra pack. Okay, we have a Zombie Token. A very cool island. I'll chuck that in as well. Chandra's Magmut Foil. And rare is Nyambi Esteem Speaker. Legend and Creature Human Cleric 2142. So it has Flash. And when the Ambia Steam Speaker ends Birdfield, you may return another target creature controlled to its owner's hand. If you do, you gain life equal to that creature's converted mana cost. For one white and blue, tap, discard a legendary card. You get to draw two cards. And Uncommon's Archfiend's Vessel. Canopy Stalker, Wildwood Scourge. Some cool artwork on that one. And the Commons, Deathbloom Thalid. Prismite. Mateshift Battalion, Silent Dart, Lofty Denial. Hunter's Edge, Bone Pit Brute, Grasp of Darkness, and Ranger's Guile. So what are people thinking of this set as compared to Core 2021? Uh, Core 2020, I should say. Um, I think it's much better than Core 2019, but uh, probably maybe a little better than Core 2020. Let me know what you think in the comments. And we have a Goblin Wizard, Creature Goblin Wizard 1-1 token, yes! Love the goblins and a island and heroic intervention is a rare. Instant for two, permanence you control gain, hexproof and indestructible until end of turn. And the uncommon seasoned hello blade, Talarian Kraken, very nice, chrome replicator, and more mind rot, which some people might say is every video on the channel, but you would be absolutely right. Moving on, thrill of possibility, blood glutton, feet of resistance. Igneous Kerr, also known as the Hot Dog Cancel, Liliana's Steward, Snare Spinner, Scorching Dragonfire, and Teferi's Protege. Okay, last pack here for SP and KS. So that uh, Heroic Intervention is probably the pick of the bunch so far. We have a Soldier Token, Mountain, and a Foil Gormand. That's a nice pun, and a Mythic. Massacre Worm, yes, Creature Worm, 6546. So when he enters the battlefield, creatures your opponent's control get minus two, minus two until oh, end of turn. And whenever a creature an opponent controls dies, that player loses two life. Very cool pull there, and Uncommon Sanctum of Calm Waters, Alpine Houndmaster, Rin Wingmare, and the Commons, Sanguine Indulgence, Vodalian Arcanist, Sure Strike. Capture Sphere for all your Pokemon capturing needs. Concordia Pegasus, Burn Bright, Basri's Acolyte, Snare Spinner, Pitchburn Devils, and that is it. Okay, so some tasty pulls there for SP and KS. 
Pop those in there. Moving on, we have Ash Geekalotl. Thank you for being a patron. So, see if we can get some more Mythics here. Okay, very cool Construct token. Some range things a little better down here. Thank you. Oh, it's out of control. Never mind. Construct, I'll chuck that in for you as well. Mountain and a foil portcullis vine. And another mythic Basri Ket. Nice. Sledgehammer Planeswalker Basri. Three loyalty for three. His plus one, put a plus one, plus one counter on up to one target creature. It gains indestructible on two out of turn. His minus two whenever one or more non token creatures attack this turn. Create that many one one white sword creature tokens that are tapped and attacking. Minus six. You get an emblem with it at the beginning of combat on your turn. Create a one one white sword creature token and put a plus one, plus one counter on each creature you control. Very nice indeed. And a Havoc Jester for the uncommons. Fierce Empath, Shipwreck, Dowser, and the Commons Death Bloom, Thalad, Mistral, Singer, Dub, Mateshift Battalion, Opt, Celestial Enforcer, Sabertooth Mauler, Destructive Tampering, and Grasp of Darkness. Okay, next pack here for Ash Geekalotl. So, off to a great start with a Mythic there. We have a Knight token. He goes over there, a hey, very cool planes, I'll chuck that in as well, and a rare Glorious Anthem. Enchantment 3, creatures to control get plus one, plus one. And Uncommon's Light of Promise, Epitaph Golem, Basri's Solidarity, and Common's Fetid Imp, Titanic Growth, Masked Blackguard, Spine Megalodon, Val Valorous Steed, Life Goes On, Goblin Arsonist, Creature Goblin Shaman, very cool, Roaming Ghost Sight, and Pride Malcolm. One more card here, Turret Ogre. Okay, so we're going to move this stuff out of the way. The pile's getting a bit unwieldy. And then we shall continue. Scoop them up. All right, so there we are, Ash Geekalotl. Enjoy the pulls. Who's next? It is Barboso. Thank you for being a patron. So see if we can get a Mythic for everybody today. That would be pretty crazy. Okay, we have a Soldier Token, a Tranquil Cove, and Volcanic Salvo is a rare. Sorcery for 12, what the heck? The spell costs X, that's the cast where X is the total power of creatures you control. Okay, deals 6 damage to each of up to 2 target creatures and or planeswalkers. It's pretty destructive, and Uncommon's Pestilent Taze, Invigorating Surge, Liliana's Devotee, and the Commons... So move things around again. We have Rise again, Colossal Dreadmore, Sanguine Indulgence, Return to Nature, Wishcoin Crab, Valorous Steed, Garrick Scorehorn, I still can't get over that blank spot there, Turret Ogre, Rousing Reed, and Ranger's Guile. Okay, so Liliana, where are some crazy pulls? I would like, whoa, I'm throwing packs around here. I would like to pull a Liliana today. Let's see what we can get. So, MTG Arena. What are you playing in the arena lately? Leave a note in the comments. We got a Thornwood Falls and Joriel Monvuli Recluse is the rare. They're doing a creature human druid, one, two for two. So, whenever you draw your second card each turn, create a two, two green cat creature token. And for four and two green and two end of turn creatures you control have base power and toughness XX, where X is the number of cards in your hand. Okay, Uncommon's Miscast. Uh, he goes there, Sanctum of Tranquil Light, Avon Gaggle Master, that thing's crazy. And common Sanguine Indulgence, Sky Scanner, Alchemist Gift, Read the Tides, Dub, Onake Ogre, Library Larsenist, Drowsing Tyranidon, Goblin Wizardry, nice! Daybreak Charger, and that is it for another pack, so enjoy those, Barboso. Stay tuned, later in the month we'll have the Patron Snap Packs, always a fun time. Next up we have Sebastian Blackwell, thank you for being a Patron, and that pull tab went all the way down just about. Oh, here's the Pirate Token, goes along with that whale, I'll chuck him in there. We've got a Swamp, and <laughs> the rare Conspicuous Snoop Creature Goblin Rogue, 2-2 two, two for 2, play to the top card of your library revealed. You may cast goblin spells from the top of your library as long as the top card of your library is a goblin card. Conspicuous Snoop has all activated abilities of that card. That is pretty crazy. And Uncommon's Malefic Scythe. 
Reign of Revelation, Siege Striker, and the Commons Gloom Sower, Vidalian Arcanist, Death Bloom Thalid, Feet of Resistance, Silent Tart, Tome Anima, Gale Swooper, Destructive Tampering, Hunter's Edge, Scorching Dragonfire, and that is it. Okay, another pack of Core 2021 here. And if you missed yesterday's video, we had some pretty tasty pulls in that one. I'll pop a link up in the corner, you can check it out. We got stuck into a brand new box of mystery boosters. Excuse me, I'm losing my voice here. It must be the goblins, goblin wizard. Here he is. Jungle Hollow, a foil Vidalian Arcanus, and the rare is Stormwing Entity. Creature Elemental 3-3 three, three for 5, so this spell costs 2 and a blue, less cast if you cast an instant or sorcery spell this turn, as Flying and Prowess, and when it ends Badfield, Scry 2. And the Uncommon Sanctum of Stone Fangs, Cultivate, Leafkin Avenger, and the Commons Colossal Dreadmore, Walking Corpse! Staunch Shieldmate, Return to Nature, Library Larcenist, Browsing Tyranodon, Crash Through, Daybreak Charger, Nailed Sage, and that is it. Okay, so there we are. You got a goblin today, Sebastian. You are a true winner. All right. And last patron here, it is Andres Castillo. Thank you for being a patron, a brand new patron here. Gets a signed Jackalope Herd for his first month as a patron. Good luck, sir. We have MTG Arena, a forest. And the rare is Sporeweb Weaver, Creature Spider 1, 4 for 3. So it has Reach and Hexproof from Blue, and whenever it's still damage, you gain my life and create a 1-1 one, one green Sepulchre Creature token. And the Uncommons, we have Unsubstantiate, Experimental Overload, Volcanic Geyser, and the Commons, Turn to Slag, Alchemist Gift, Walking Corpse, Read the Tides, Warded Battlement, Silent Dart, Crash Through, Roaming Ghostlight, Drowsing Tyranodon, and Chandra's Magmat. Okay, next pack here for Andres, and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button for more Magic the Gathering unboxings, and be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released. Okay, we got a Griffin token, a Scoured Barons, and yes, you do realize we have to slow roll things here. We do get a foil today. Okay, Uncommons, we have Hellcat Punisher, Miscast, Leafkin Avenger, and the Commons Crypt Lurker, Short Sword, Fetid Imp, Defiant Strike, Spine Megalodon, Legion's Judgment, Hobble Fiend, Finishing Blow, Pride Malkin, and that is it. Okay, so what is the foil here? You get a foil, a Nake Ogre, and the rare is Temple of Epiphany. So land and Spadfield tapped. When it enters Spadfield, scry one, tap it for blue or red. So there we have it. Enjoy the pulls. We'll tuck these in here for you, sir. And I hope everyone is staying safe and healthy out there. Thanks for watching and have a great day.